With the investigation being handed over to Arkansas State Police, those in the county are wondering what led to Deputy Smith dying in the first place. Tonight, our Hayden Savage has new reaction from the sheriff and the family of the fallen deputy. Deputy Smith was a faithful servant, a husband. He was a father. That's how many describe Stone County Deputy Justin Smith. Both his family at home and at work say they can't wrap their minds around what's happened. Right now we're just kind of all still in shock a little bit about uh, how this could have happened and, and hoping for answers in the coming weeks. Everybody at this agency is heartbroken to have suffered a tragedy such as this. Ashley said he and his entire family was proud of his father's work to get to where he was at the sheriff's office. We were proud of him. Uh, it took him a long time to get there. Uh, and he put a lot of work in. And we we're very proud that he got to that point. When bringing Deputy Smith's body back from the state crime lab in Little Rock on Wednesday afternoon, he was escorted by a sea of blue and greeted by many waving flags. The son added that the last few miles into town show how loved his father truly was. It was that last a uh, few miles uh, pointing to Mountain View, seeing all the people out there, uh, seeing the car, uh, um, everyone waving flags, and uh, it was uh, it was heartwarming and heartbreaking at the same time. Regarding the investigation, Sheriff Long said it's now in the hands of the state police, and he's hoping more questions are answered in the coming days. I have a lot of questions myself, and I'm ready for them to conclude their investigation that I hope will be done here in the coming weeks. In Mountain View, Hayden Savage, K8 News. At this time, funeral arrangements for Deputy Smith have not been announced. Across Arkansas, law enforcement and state officials have been responding to Deputy Smith's death. Governor Sarah Huckabee Sanders said his passing will be mourned by all who loved him. She plans to have the flags lowered in honor of his service and sacrifice. Attorney General Tim Griffin said Smith's death is heartbreaking and it's a reminder of the risks that go into serving as a law enforcement officer. He said he will do everything he can to support the sheriff's office in this time of need.